citizens of the reject nation, it is time to demolish a man. Ooh. I've never seen Demolition Man. John no. has never seen Demolition never. Man. Never. You know what I know about this movie? What do you know? Travolta. Nope. Still alone. <laughs> You know what else I know? Great stuff. Wesley Snipes. Yes. And always. Taco Bell. Ooh. That's all I know. I'm at the Pizza Hut. I'm at the Taco Bell. I'm watching Demolition Man with Koi. And John Travolta. That's so crazy. we're going to dive into this classic Grease sequel, Demolition Man. I'm excited. Now, please leave a like. Leave a comment. <laughs> let us know what you thought of this experience of us. This is probably the most classic movie I have zero exposure to. I haven't even seen a trailer. Mm. So I'm very excited to find out what's going on here. I'd like you to hit that thumbs up so you can let us know that you liked what was going on here. And I would like to thank G Fuel for helping us fuel what's going on here. Drink of the future oh, yeah. right there. <laughs> Hear that? Hear that? That's energy. That's success. Ah. That's victory. And it's and quenching. It's quenching. Hit the link in the description and use promo code REJECTNATION for 20% off select tubs. If you would like to watch our entire experience, head on over to the Patreon, become a super sexy reject to watch us from beginning to end, start to finish, fueled all the way through with our resting watching faces. So get on over there and be a Patreon. Without further ado, let's watch Demolition Man in 3, 2, I didn't live here yet, but I assume this is the future. I've seen the Los Angeles destroyed so many times so in recent many memory. Times. <laughs> 96 is a rough year for LA. It's okay. New York's been taking a beating in a lot of these movies That's for a true. long That's time. That's true. Let's mix it up. Go West Coast. <laughs> LAPD Hoppers. Oh, man. Remember when they used to let commercial airlines land in this town? <laughs> Where we're going? Or why the hell we're bothered, anyhow? Well, do we recorded this deep. idea. It's very clean. Maniac hijacked a municipal bus with 30 passengers on it. That's a pretty good reason. And I got a real bad hunch where those passengers are and where that maniac is. You want to share it yeah. with us? Phoenix. Simon Phoenix. Ooh, there's a name. Simon Phoenix. Damn. Diving into the ashes, I mean, this Phoenix. Uh, uh. Is this where Cap got it from? <laughs> it was in a comic, but maybe it's after Stallone. All greatest action moments are inspired by Stallone. That's right? true. Go, boy. Yeah. And a maniac to catch one. Expendable zero. You just said it takes a maniac to catch one. Yes. What a great opening five minutes live. I love this. Yeah. Like first first couple minutes, you know exactly what kind of movie you're in. <laughs> yes. The run and shoot. Whoa. I like this Dutch angle coverage. Yeah, it is. Great. Damn, a smart dude. henchman. That man can hench and shoot. <laughs> Dutch can do, do another Dutch? He can do it all. Who shot this movie? I love it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Wow, these stunts hit hard. So does he. Oh. Extreme close-ups are killing it. Got my anime villain knife. Man, the 90s were just going. Don't move, Phoenix. Simon Phoenix. You're under arrest. For tax evasion. Arrest? Shit. <laughs> and you're trespassing. Uh-oh. Where are the passengers? Well, they're, uh... F*** you. <laughs> <laughs> this is between you and me. And this gun. What? What? What you got? So Ooh. Do something. Soldier Boy tell him. Oh, he's standing in it. What a great standoff. Is it cold in here? Or is it just me? Yeah, come on, dude. You had to know. Oh. Is the one's name Spartan? I hope so. Or is that just the type of cop? The league he's in, yeah. Ooh. Snipes outfit also killing it. Yeah, dude. Those Beetlejuice pants. The near future of fashion. I swear, I'd lose my head if it wasn't attached. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. Oh, that's, yeah, that's going to come back later. Oh, yeah, you think he's beheaded? I think he gets beheaded. Yeah, I don't have to. Oh, C4 oh. canisters, but why? Practical explosion. Come on, 93. <laughs> yeah, let's do this. Come on. Let's get every angle, every shot. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Explode. Coverage. 
Ah, uh, when they used to actually blow up warehouses. Ah, uh, right. Guys, it's sort of demolition, man. You know, really, really living up to that title. Right at the top. <laughs> this need building needed to be demolished. He's he doing, was doing the city his a job. service. Oh, yeah. Wesley Snipes is just a demolition man. Stallone's trying to stop. Yeah. He doesn't like the way he does it. You are not supposed to come down here. You are not supposed to attempt the arrest of Phoenix single handed. And you are not supposed to blow anything up. <laughs> That's what cops are supposed to do. All that stuff. <laughs> Trying to nail this cycle for two years. Try remembering a little thing called official police procedure. It's the cop from Lethal Weapon, which you haven't seen yet. Oh. Soon it'll be more exciting. This is a crossover. Oh. It's the captain from Lethal Weapon. Bodies everywhere. There must be 20 or 30. You see that, Captain? I told him. He said he didn't care. Oh, my God. How could you say? Oh, my God. That was a great cold open. Sure. These, like, superhero and, at odds. And God, what a hook, too. You think he's like swooping in, badass saving the yeah. day? <laughs> 20, 30 people die? Yeah. Joel Silver at the height of his powers. This is like, what, six years out from Matrix? Ooh. These fonts, even. <laughs> I want my name to ever look as cool as this. Swa. Microsoft Word before we all had it. Whoa, Sandy Bullock's in this? Hey. All right. All Just right. got blindsided by some Sandy B. Uh, that's right. Nicely done. I'm William Smithers, acting as assistant warden, hereby carry out this sentence. Smithers? You've been sentenced to 70 years, sub-zero rehabilitation in the California Cryo Penitentiary yes. for the involuntary manslaughter of 30 a... innocent civilians. Whoa, 30. Woof. That is a jacked man. You'll be eligible for parole no earlier than the year 2046. Wow. Blade Runner 2046. Jesse Ventura, too? <laughs> He's a different Ooh. kind of cut. God. Pan down, cowards. <laughs> Show how, us the Stallone. See how jacked he is downstairs. I mean, they called him the Italian style. Oh, he's just going to be sent into the future like Terminator. Oh, he's going to pop in. Naked, you know, <sighs> all fours. What a weird pose to freeze somebody. <laughs> Squatting. Also, what is, if they're frozen, how do they rehabilitate? Yeah, like I know. How, right? how, do you, how do you learn? <laughs> how are you what are you learning ideas? here? <laughs> it's like taking a nap. Oh, oh, yeah. So close, boy. So close. Well shaded. Yeah. You looked. <laughs> Get that goo extra milky, okay? Make sure it's a little cloudy right over there. I want anybody to see my Italian stallion. I know? named them Adrian. I don't get I it I named them Toitles. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's a frozen man. Well, believe a man can free. His name is Spartan. Yeah, John Spartan and Simon Phoenix. It's like freaking face off in here. <laughs> this does feel face off esque, certainly. It's a good good time. Ooh. Ooh. Not yet ready for parole, but still the future. <laughs> oh, he is. I've seen so much. He's aware. <laughs> yeah, he's thinking in there. He's alive it's in there. It's not great. It's only nine years away. Isn't that Are weird? You? 2032 is only nine years away. Oh, don't remind me of things like that right now, <laughs> Coy. No, I'm here to be whisked away into a fanciful future, all right? Less than a decade. On a fanciful, horrible present. <laughs> Fellow greetings, Ordinary. Young Sandra Bullock. I'm hereby querying you on the prison population update. Close in the car. Does the tedium continue? The prisoners are ice cubes. They never move. Great exposition conversation, guys. This feels very awful. I'll fiber opt you back after the morning parole hearing. I'll fiber opt you back. We have fiber. He's basically on an iPad. She's driving a Tesla right now. Yeah, this is like not <laughs> as far as future tech goes. This was 93. This is pretty accurate. Retina well, coding well. accepted. A classic. William Smithers, still. be well. Oh, he's a Smithers too. Oh, he's the same Smithers. He's just older. That should have been obvious. <laughs> I was like his son. Whoa. What? Cool! On Earth! <laughs> Life is hell. I'm just gonna go out and say future taggers are, are not as cool as, as past taggers. It's not even a person. What are you, what are you proving? It. Food, glorious food. There'll be another one in about 12 hours. Talk, Talk about, about cuisine valet. People are hungry. We got nothing left to lose. Tell Dennis Leary. Get that Taco Bell. Dennis Leary looking like Bo Burnham in the side. <laughs> 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 
Very much so. I would have Great dread reminiscent outfit. Greetings, everyone. Yeah, definitely dread Lovely Lenina. Hey, freaking a dread Rob Schneider! There's this subplot of Rob Schneider action movies. They're all connected. They're all set in this universe yeah. with these outfits. I monitored your disheartening and distressing comments to the warden this morning. Do you really long for chaos and disharmony? <laughs> Sanctimonious asshole. Lenina Huxley, you are fined one half credit for a sort of voce violation of the verbal moralities. Put one in the swear jar. <laughs> oh, it's <that's> amazing. <laughs> I love this future. Leave the weapon poster! Whoa! That was tense. Yeah, don't you get bored code tracing perps who break curfew and tell dirty jokes? Oh, I find my job deeply fulfilling. I find their jokes very funny. You're still addicted to the 20th century. The Joker. High from its harshness, buzzed by its brutality. Oh! Blood sugar sex magic, red-eyed chili peppers. 29 years ago, the parole system as you know it. What? 537-29. Stop it! <laughs> Stop speaking Spanish! Teddy bear. Ooh. <laughs> Skin in Casually position. just steps off. Ooh. The two can fight, man. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! How do you know the password to the cuffs? I wish I knew. Simon says die. Oh, Simon, Simon says. says. Let's get this over quickly. Oh, my. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> great what a great cut. cut. What a great <laughs> cut. What a great Jesus Christ. You too. <laughs> I love this movie. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> It's got like Fifth Element vibes. There's like a lot. This is of street fun 90s. This is Street Fighter to face off Mortal Kombat. Yes, a hundred percent. What's a one eight seven? Identify code one eight seven. MDK oh, murder death, death kill. kill. Whoa, an MDK murder death kill. I love that band. Diagnostic check. Gordon William Smithers. Injury, severe eye trauma. Condition critical. Vital signs failing. Oh, and, and my dude in the chair. Subject deceased. 187. Oh, yeah. What is his name? He's great. Peterson Scott, 730. Phoenix. Phoenix. Simon Phoenix is code now. Access code for Phoenix, Simon. He was chill back during the 20th before they started lowjacking everybody. Phoenix. <laughs> Declared his own kingdom. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh. He's done one of everything. Busy guy in the 80s and 90s. Main cryo prison parking zone. Enhancing image. Oh, no. Dr. Mostow. Oh, 187. Deceased. Is a doctor's conveying still in the parking zone? The answer is no. And he murdered death, killed all the other car's tires. Just in time. Fixing location, Beverly Hills. Robertson. Doheny. Yes. Beverly Drive. Hey. Accurate. Proceed with extreme assertiveness. Doctor's vehicle has like been loaded. code fixed. <laughs> Approaching the corner of... <laughs> Guys, high-fiving's too violent. <laughs> I just gotta get close. like, placid and, and, you know... Innocuous everything is, like, yeah. so sterile. It's Super Mario. Oh, that <laughs> outfit is amazing. Anything special about me? You are an incredibly sensitive man who inspires joy, joy feelings in. I need this machine. Oh, I want a street therapist. Angelus Information Network Automated Banking. Whoa. Jesus. Friendly, Edgar, listed offenses, civil unrest activity. Don't you hear, Lord? Don't you have a job to do? Don't, don't you have someone, someone to kill? Does he have heterochromia? I don't think in regular life, but there it looked like it. Someone to kill. Yeah, like hacked in his cryo. Edgar Friendly must die. Oh no, he's got a murder death, kill him. Referred to as a pistol. Abuse. Look, I don't need a history lesson. Come on, Hal. Where the goddamn gun? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Sing me a song, why don't you? For a violation of the verbal morality standard. Fuck oh. you. Oh my god. Has caused me to notify the San Angeles Police Department. <laughs> Please remain where wow. you are. Wow. Remain where you are. He's gonna come tackle man. you for dropping a couple F bombs. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, they're right there. there. I, I know that they're, <laughs> they're coming for different reasons, but also. <laughs> Request advice. A firm tone of voice. Demand me. 
Maniac, lie down. <laughs> maniac, lie down. Excuse me, Maniac. <laughs> oh, I'm so scared. Approach and repeat ultimatum in an even firmer tone of voice. Add the words, or else. <laughs> lie down on the ground, or else. <laughs> Great well, delivery. The conviction. Anti graffiti activation program activated. Aborted. Human presence detected. Uh, override it. You got this. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! That is the anti graffiti system. <laughs> this guy's good at murder, death, killing. Let's do some martial yes. arts. Cut to a wide. Show us some of those moves. You cast them for a reason. We're police officers. We're not trained to handle this kind of violence. <laughs> Ah. You better start learning. Simon says, everybody, stay. There you go. <laughs> oh, oh, <free>. Play ball. <laughs> that guy lost. He didn't stand up. Nope. He's out. He's out. He's out in the rest of the movie. Yeah. That man is playing Galaga. Thought we wouldn't notice, but we did. The real problem lies in the man whose initials mark the detonating graffiti. The man behind the EF, Mr. Edgar Friendly. EF. Men and women who have left the comfort of our society only to spew hostility yes. at the very bosom that they have relinquished. Yes, not too far-fetched. This radical terrorist behavior led by uh, Mr. Friendly but, must not be allowed to undermine our safety. From what, Beetlejuice and stuff? Oh, yeah. Yeah. A cryocon has affected self-release from the penitentiary. Murder, death, kills, all categories of chaos. Enhance your calm. <laughs> Enhance your calm. You got it, Mel Brooks. It I want you to do everything in your power to snare this agent of destruction. It's very Mel Brooks. You have my utmost confidence. Utmost confidence. <laughs> How was the fiendish Simon Phoenix apprehended back in the 20th? 12 state manhunt. Wow. Woo. A video bite on unsolved mysteries. Hey, Robert Stack. In the end, it took just one man, John Spartan. <laughs> Called him the Demolition Man. There you go. Yeah, they did. There you have a title. Good. How can you justify destroying a seven million dollar mini mall to rescue a girl whose ransom was only twenty five thousand dollars? <laughs> So good. <laughs> it's the principal. You could reinstate him. Simon Phoenix is an old fashioned criminal. We need an old fashioned cop. <laughs> True that, boy. <laughs> this plot's so good. Oh, no. Get out, Mr. Loans. Do it. Switch their faces. Yeah, it's due. <laughs> Gotta find out what happens. To catch an old fashioned criminal, you need an old fashioned cop. The demolition man. Well, 618 of a That is an uncomfortable position to be asleep in. Yeah. He's going to be stiff. Let's see him. Oh, he's going to Terminator out of there. Yeah. I wonder if Stallone saw Arnold and was like, I will be more shredded and more naked. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I am Lieutenant Lenina Huxley. The year is 2032. It's not like a process. My wife. What happened to my wife? Oh, we froze your whole family. Her light was extinguished in the big one of 2010. Whoa. The big, big one. The big one. She died in an earthquake. Of Zelle, the earthquake. Don't we've you been, remember the 2010 about... earthquake, Coy? That's true. That's true. Yeah, <laughs> I'm Chief of Police George Earl. We didn't thaw you out for a family reunion. Because <laughs> they're dead. Because they are dead. <laughs> this is about you and the cryocon, Simon Phoenix. What? <laughs> Why did you say that name? <laughs> You will give me a Marlboro. Yes, of course, right away. What's a, a Marlboro? <laughs> yeah. It's a cigarette, any cigarette. I mean, that's pretty accurate, too. Smoking is not good for you, and has been deemed that anything not good for you is bad. Hence, illegal. Alcohol, caffeine, contact sports, meat. Are you shitting me? What snowflake future is this? Bad language, chocolate, gasoline, uneducational toys, and anything spicy. Chocolate has it's anything so spicy, spicy as things its benefits. So good for dopamine. He went to the bathroom. I, I guess he got all thought out. Oh. <laughs> oh, dread. Nice. Formally convey my presence. <laughs> <There> you <go. laughs> You're out of toilet paper. They're 
all the days in the future. They used handfuls of wadded paper back in the 20s. <laughs> <laughs> what an idiot. You got this little shelf with three seashells on it. He doesn't know how to use the three seashells. <laughs> Is he just walking around <laughs> poopy back there? What's happening with the shells? Someone explain the shells. Zach Lamb, I got older. <laughs> We're not too old for this shit. They finally grounded me. Shit. <laughs> this is how insecure heterosexual males used to bond. <laughs> bars. Movies won't well, turn it off. Shit. Bars. <laughs> yeah, perhaps. So much for the seashells. What are the seashells? Oh my god. He just made toilet paper out of swearing. <laughs> now that is a magic trick. <laughs> Phoenix is going for a gun. The only place a person can even view a gun in this city is uh, at a museum. What? It belongs in a museum. Well, that's where we might find him. You said it, boy. They do such a cool job of making the past, the, 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 the present, the past, and using, like, this era's present as artifacts. Yeah. Like the posters, the pop culture. This is great. Welcome, Lieutenant Lenina Huxley. Huxley, Aldous Huxley, Brave New World. Nicely done, uh, sci-fi. Nicely done, clever, sci-fi. Clever, clever, clever. He's a Spartan warrior, a man of bare bones integrity. Mm. Spartan Phoenix from the ashes, first one woken up. Wall to wall mini tunes. You call them commercials. Here's that classic okay. you've all been waiting for. The number one request of the day: Armor Hot Dog. Kids eat Armor Hot Dog. Oh my God. <laughs> my nightmare. Play the McDonald's song. This is my nightmare. <laughs> Play State Farm. Somebody put me back in the fridge. <laughs> oh, you'll be there soon enough. The armory exhibit. You will find display. Wow! Wow! Ouch! This is what I'm talking about. You gotta wait that 15 day waiting period? <laughs> or can I just like take one now? Ooh, owie. Mellow greetings. What seems to be your boggle? <laughs> Andrew Santino? <laughs> How much do you weigh? Well, I happen to weigh for this. Oh my goodness. No, that is not that. Okay. Didn't expect Mellow it to work. Greetings. Here we are. Hey, Luke Skywalker. Use the force. <laughs> hey, what the hell is this? All right. It's a glow rod. That's a lightsaber. What we got. Does it work? <laughs> wow. I guess so. Wow. That's, that's just a cattle prod. He just like bonked, knocked that guy out. Wait, this proceeds for that. Around there, they're all in that 90s smear. Right? Yeah, I think it's like Nemesis. Oh, boy. The museum is no longer sealed, is it? I'm a blast from the past. Yes, you are. Who is that? I was hoping you would use a cannon. Oh, no, oh, awesome. Now he's using a future cannon. Simon says bleed. Simon says bleed. The music in the Hall of Violence. Oh, yeah. This is the Hall of Sick Beats. Wow. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> you gonna get charged for that? Oh, snap. He's like a real street driver. Is the city like buried? Yeah, like Did they New just build right like, on top of it. It looks like it. Pass is over, John. Time for something new and improved. Oh, oh. I love this gun. God damn. <laughs> Fight the rain. Oh boy. Yeah, get that kick. Oh. The boxer versus the kickboxer is great. Yeah. Oh, soldier boy. <laughs> soldier boy, tell him. You're on TV. Hey. <laughs> oh, that You're would hurt. TV. TV's on you. Your death button. Forgot to say Simon says. Yeah. Oh, and he gets him back the way he got him. Woo. Electricity, fire, mirroring, great. That's a brand new world. Sorry, you gotta go. Brand new world, there you go. <laughs> I 
I think Blave, Brave New World does have a more like docile future. Sir, the stress bringer is inside being demobilized as we speak. Stress bringer. Don't worry, I'll get you with the next shot. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> no kiss kiss, no bang bang. Mm -hmm. How do you like that, Shane Black? Mr. Edgar, friendly. Don't you have someone to kill? I'm gonna take it. You programmed him. Mm, yes, yes. Just going out with a I hunch feel here. Like going it out might on a limb. Have been expressed that yeah, yeah, might have Then go and do your job. Venus! Shit. Saved by the bell. <laughs> How much did Taco Bell pay? <laughs> I'm very curious. You got a tagline. There's only been one photo, like a little tag. So far, I gotta say, I was expecting more Taco I Bell. I was told coin. Taco Bell Demolition Man was important. It's all I know. You scared him away. I, I don't know how to thank you. You saved my life. No problem. <laughs> Those hats. Who is this man? Detective John Spartan, temporarily reinstated. You told us to do everything in our power to capture the madman. Oh yes, yes, I did, I did. <laughs> Oh shit, that's right. Ooh. Oh, there's another one. Okay, yeah. I would like you to accompany me to Taco Bell. There, okay. All right, let's go. Uh, Look forward to it. it. Thank Thank you. I'm very excited about it. <laughs> Get me some to cheesy Taco gordita Bell. crunches in here, yeah. And hey, they brought the Mexican pizza back in 2021, and that's when you're on the right side of that leap. <laughs> yeah. Those five years were dark for humanity. And when Phoenix performs another murder death kill, we'll know exactly where to pounce. Great plan. Thank you. Benjamin Brad just looks like he's here from high school or something. I, I love. Hey, we're going the to Long Beach Comic Con. Convention Center. That was San Diego, I think. Or San Diego, yeah. one of those places. We're going to Comic Con and Taco Bell. I'm at the combination of Comic Con <laughs> and Taco Bell. Schwarzenegger Library. Oh, yes, Schwarzenegger, the Schwarzenegger Library. Presidential Library. President Schwarzenegger after governor. He was president? Yes. Even though he was not born in this country, his popularity at the time caused the 61st Amendment, which states that... I don't want to know. <laughs> Amazing. Is this when the rivalry was ending? It must have been. I guess. Oh, that's so good. Or was this in relation to when the Simpsons predicted President Schwarzenegger? I mean... It was probably before that. I didn't expect you to kill somebody. <laughs> Love that smell. Reminds me of biscuits and gravy. I could go for biscuits and gravy. Yeah, sounds good. So let's talk about. Edgar Friendly, prepare for Simon Phoenix. <laughs> I like Mexican food, but... Your tone is quasi-facetious, but you do not realize that Taco Bell was the only restaurant to survive the franchise wars. The franchise wars? Now all restaurants are Taco Bell. Oh, <laughs> no way. <laughs> The franchise wars all restaurants are Taco Bell. I love their redesigned logo. Oh, this is so good. Wait. It's a fancy restaurant. It's actually Mexican food now. Oh, my God. Valley of the Jolly <laughs> Green <laughs> Giant. Taco Bell. Oh. All restaurants are Taco Bell. Aren't they making, like, upscale Taco Bells now? Yes. <laughs> it's leading to this. We're getting there. Oh, my God. You weren't here when the real disturbances began. Civilization tried to destroy itself. Of course. The city degenerated into a total fear zone. The citizenry cocooning in their homes, afraid to go out. People just wanted the madness over. So I'm talking about one. Sounds like, sounds like New York in any 80s movie. But my cryo sentence was no sweet lullaby. I had feelings and I had thoughts. How about a 36-year nightmare about people caught in a burning building? Oh. And my wife beating her fist against a block of ice that used to be her husband. Then you were nice enough to wake me up and let me know everything that meant something in my life is gone. Wow. The side effects of the cryo process are unavoidable. You were found guilty of criminal no. charges you owed. No. Don't attack the Taco Bell. Oh. 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 Yeah, Tennis Leary. Let's go, Bo. The scraps. The food in the truck. They just gotta Grab the big box. Come on, move, move. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yes, oh my god. He I knows love their like tire shoulder pads. Yeah, the bad backs of it all. He knows how to do violence. You're gonna regret this the rest of your life. Both seconds of it. <laughs> <laughs> I like that cut in for the second line that they added later. Both, Both seconds, seconds of, of it. it. Ah! Yeah, oh. Oh. Presence. Even as Bubba. <laughs> Even as I can't. That's all I see when I see him in this movie. <laughs> 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 what 
<laughs> well done. Hey, Cruz, oh. Please don't. Oh, I've seen that guy in a in a GIF. I'm very excited for the like Ridge's Thomas Live speech. Are those like vitamins? Who are those guys? They're known as scraps. Outcasts and deserters who choose to live beneath us in sewers and abandoned tunnels. The Morlocks. <laughs> yeah. Strangely we've been scrapped in those roundhouse punches. Posse, look, this isn't the Wild roundhouse West, okay? Punches. The Wild West wasn't even the Wild West. <laughs> Hurting people's not a good thing. Oh. Sometimes it is, but not when it's a bunch of people looking for something to eat. Oh. Oh. Mmm, you're going against their way. You didn't like that, did you? Something tells me this tranquil future is not all that it seems. Ah, perhaps the scraps will get a humanizing moment soon. I keep looking around and I think about my daughter growing up in a place like this, and I'm afraid she's gonna think I'm some kind of primitive. But I mean, as much as I want to see her. Driving on the convention center? Is she his daughter? That'd be weird. Only if they kiss. That would be weird. <laughs> a little Star Warsy. I could do a search no. for you. Oh. Feel very protective of you all of a sudden. Mm. Subject change. Eternal even. I got what you wanted. Oh, great. Oh, my. Remember how cool tiny CDs used to be? Remember the phase of mini discs? <laughs> yeah. Ooh, Before the cube. iPod, there were the mini discs. How did you get in? Wish I knew. I got past codes, complete access to the industrial data grid interface. Now I don't even know what that shit means. <laughs> He mean to ask you about it because I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. <laughs> Snipes is having so much fun in this. Snipes is directing himself. Oh, 100%. <laughs> Your job is to kill Mr. Edgar Friendly and stop a revolution before he precipitates. That was why you were rehabilitated. Was that what we're going to call it? I'll need about five or six more special men. His tire outfit is so good. Have a list. Wouldn't want you to defrost any of those mad dog killer types, you know what I mean? And none of them motherfuckers from New York. <laughs> I want Jason Statham, Terry Crews, Randy Couture. Expendables 4 now playing. <laughs> what is John Spartan doing here? You finish your business, and I'll stuff him back in the freezer. Think of him as a guarantee. Well, you don't have much of a guarantee. I took care of Spartan once, I'll take care of him again. Deceit. Life. Oh my. What do you think? The jukebox and everything. The perfect 20th century apartment. Me oh, too. Pepsi? Very... Isn't it? Ooh. I'm a Pepsi girl. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Before the like Taco Bell fast food wars. is owned by Pepsi. <laughs> so Pepsi technically survived the fast food That's wars. That's true. That's true. Not so much a causal effect, mm. but a general state of, of neurological arousal. After having observed your behavior this evening. Oh my. I was wondering if you would like to have sex. <laughs> oh my. It's like. Oddly kind of sweet. With you. <laughs> Here. <laughs> now. Now? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How do we do it? What is sex? What is sex in this era as presented so formally? What? There you go. What is this strange days right now? Are we going to do some playback right here? What's happening? There's a towel. I'll just relax. We'll begin in a few seconds. What? Like physical contact? People don't like to touch in this world. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. I'm so worried. Uh. Oh. 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 Oh my. Oh wow. <laughs> Always wanted to make love inside the light at a rave. <laughs> <laughs> Can we disco fuck? What is happening? Oh my. <laughs> I want I want all the uninterrupted B-roll of this scene. Yes! Alright, obviously, what do you say we just do it the old-fashioned way? Oh, disgusting. You mean fluid transfer? Oh. The, the wild mambo, the, the hunk of chunk. The, the wild, wild good mambo! The exchange of bodily fluids, do you know what that leads to? Yeah, I do. Uh, Kids smoking, a desire to raid the fridge. <laughs> not even mouth transfer is condoned. Kissing's not allowed? Oh. Damn, I was a good kisser. Oh, I bet, I bet. Procreation? Yeah. We go to a lab. Fluids are purified, screened, and, and transferred by authorized medical personnel only. It is the only legal way. Oh, boy. Nope. 
No. What are you doing? Just trying. Breaking the law. Oh. Ooh. You are a savage creature, John Spartan. <laughs> and I wish you to leave my domicile now. Uh, top 10 weirdest mainstream sex scene. Yep. <laughs> That's why we need sex scenes in movies for, for moments art like, this, like this. I agree that I want the cut scenes of just alone, like, <laughs> so good. I want all my clothes to just be shaped to show off all the best features. Like, Stallone gets to design, like, what if I've got like a Mandarin color? Oh, he doesn't know how to use the three seashells. <laughs> That'll be the post credit. I want to explain a video. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. It's the mini disc. It's got like a tone. You just look like you're like ready to train in some martial Very arts temple. Very specific martial art. <laughs> yeah. Behavioral engineering. Of course. Wow, it's got all the angles too. Camera technology is not improved in 2032. <laughs> nope. Here, I made this for you. Wow. What the? Whoa. That's an incredible work. There's a cable knit and everything. Damn. So fast. When I thought out, the first thing I wanted to do was knit. I mean, how come I know what a zipper foot and a shuttle and a hook and bobbin and a petty point is? I can weave a throw rug right now with my eyes closed. Do it. For each inmate, the computer draws up a skill or trade which best suits their genetic disposition. And it would implant the knowledge and the desire to carry out whatever training was assigned. Genetically engineered to sew. Phoenix comes out and he can access computers, operate all vehicles, knows the location of every damn thing in town, and is three times stronger than when he went in. <laughs> all right, fair. I mean, sailors used to sew and knit and stuff. Very I mean, useful. That's fine, but also, yeah. <laughs> comparatively useful. Who develops these programs? Well, Cocktail Industries. Dehabilitation. Mellow apologies for my lack of physical disposition, detective, but I do have an entire city gap to run. Yeah, so. we'll run this. <laughs> They're outside the museum. Why didn't he blow your brains out? Uh, does it matter? You yeah, it matters. I saw the security disc. Full 10 seconds to figure out where to put the hole in your fucking head. Oh. This what? display of barbaric behavior was unacceptable even in your time. But it worked. Shoot the computer. Oh. Shoot him. But it works. Yeah. Phoenix has a gun to your head. 10 seconds is nine and a half seconds longer than you live. Oh, that's a good line. To solve all the difficulties in life. Kill the Game of Thrones guy. Chaos in the museum was the result of Mr. Phoenix's presence or your own. I wonder yeah. about this shithead. Wow. What the? What? Where was he? He shot the computer, so he was in that room. I guess. No, no, but I'm saying like he was physically there. How was he here? He must have been recording in the next room. Your family's dead, your past is dead. Enjoy your moment of prehistoric bravado, because after you leave here, it will be over. Return this man to cryostasis immediately. Well. Be fucked. <laughs> That's the best, best line in all film history. Be fucked. <laughs> How did he transport into that room? <laughs> Now Let's they're go. in Burbank. Oh, What's going on? What is I happening? I hope you know what you're doing. <laughs> he just left. Why would he leave? <laughs> What's happening? Why are you proceeding into the depths of wasteland? <laughs> Phoenix was in the one place that A, you can't monitor. B, you're afraid to go. And C, don't give a shit about it. <laughs> uh, Bud Light before the end of days. Yes. <laughs> Now, this is just where Bud Light ends up oh, after being progressive is down true. here. You that's know, what the, happens. The dregs. The dregs of society. All I want is a burger and a beer if you got one. How am I going to pay? Thoughts lead is better to give. Sooner Rolex. <laughs> In any generation, Rolex means money. <laughs> when is this, senor? Oh, no. Thank you. That would taste so good if you're only eating veggies and <laughs> sadness. Just don't ask where the meat comes from. Okay, yes, that's the carne. It's the carne, it's the rat. 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 Rat meat? This is a rat burger. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> Matter of fact, it's the best burger I've had in years. <laughs> I mean, it does look kind of satisfying. Just gotta not think about it. Cows are smart, friendly animals. I eat them. Delicious. Oh, 
Oh, let's well get that taken ride. care of third act car, I see. Do you know what this is? A 1970 Oldsmobile 442. <laughs> with a 455 cubic inch engine, radial tires, and, and bucket seats. Willikers. <laughs> I studied. So did I. And a little ride. Your friends, too. Come on, move. <laughs> let's go, Bo. <laughs> We're looking for a murder death killer. Can you help or just bully us with your primitive weapons? <laughs> you tell Kato it's going to take an army of assholes to get rid of me because I don't give a shit. I got nothing to lose. But I don't know who the hell you are, let alone want to take you anywhere. So stay here. Be well. <laughs> <laughs> You're the guy outside Taco Bell. <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> Delivered so <laughs> You're the guy outside Taco Bell. <laughs> Taco Bell is the third lead, in fairness. Mm. I'm the kind of guy like to sit in a greasy spoon and wonder, gee, should I have the T-bone steak or the jumbo rack of barbecue ribs with the side order of gravy fries? I want high cholesterol. Mm -hmm. Buckets of cheese, okay? I want to smoke a Cuban cigar the size of Cincinnati in a non-smoking section. Yeah. I've seen this, future. you know what it is? It's a 47-year-old virgin sitting around in his beige pajamas, drinking a banana broccoli shake, singing, I'm an Oscar Mayer Wee. Don't talk about Steve Carell like that. <laughs> Why don't you take charge and lead these people out of here? I do what I have to do. Sometimes people come with me. All I want to do is bury Cocteau up to his neck and shit and let him think happy, happy thoughts forever. Is that Jack Black? Is that Jack Black? C cut back. Cut back cut over back. there. Cut back. Was it? It like sure extra? looked like him, yeah. It tracks for when he was doing like video game commercials. Yeah. The world has become a whipped Brady Bunch version of itself. Come by a bunch of robed sissies. Jesse Ventura. Yay. We get to kill the man who put most of us behind the freezer. We get to kill John Spartan. Exactly. Oh, no. Two for the price of one. Let's take him, boys. Whoa! Oh. Jesus! Whoa! Oh, that's clever. We had reached the point at which I am not sure where this is going to end up. <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out how he teleported next to that Pope guy. I know. <laughs> <laughs> This is oh like my, my second God. favorite snipes next to Blade. I'm so happy yeah. for, for him. This is just madcap glee. <laughs> I'll be goddamn like a New York cockroach. <laughs> as big as one. Oh, 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 that was cool. Good shot. <laughs> yes, that's the that's the Damn approach. It, Benjamin Bratt. Definitely not getting that high school credit now. Nope. It's all been taken. Detention even. <laughs> Did his heterochromia eye change? Is it now on the other side? I thought it the, the left eye was blue. Right eye was blue just then? Oh, no. Maybe it was a, a shot they had to reverse. Could have been. Like they had to physically. Because I don't think you get a contact wrong. That seems pretty. Someone's there to take pictures for contact. <laughs> for an entire Whoa. movie. Whoa. Okay, now what? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, yeah, move, please. Christ's sake. Oh, that's a beautiful car. Mm. It's at a new Oldsmobile dealership. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Jeez. Oh, it's the LA Tunnel. All right. I like how they futured up just enough. Yeah, yeah. It's really make it feel like we went there. All the way. Okay, okay, I've read all about this now. Okay. So what do I do? I just I just push this pedal. Whoa! Oh boy. Oh no. Push the pedal as hard as you can. Just catch up to him. Oh no. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> yeah. No. no. Off. Remember those moody bus passengers Whoa. that you flew apart? Trying to catch me? They were already dead! <laughs> Ugh. 
Jeez, that's a twist. That's fun. Cold as heaven does, so pure evil. Gotta still be able to use the wheel with the thing in contracted. Oh. Hey. Oh. It's foam. It's just suds. <laughs> oh, I guess it fills. Oh, okay, okay. It looked like soap suds. I was in like, that one why shot. is it Barbasol? Is <laughs> yeah. that gonna save you? You know, you pack enough of it in there. There's no way that's the end of Wesley Snipes. Who you think it is, huh? Hey. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Jeez. It's a good thing he works out. Let's get a guy out of that phone. <laughs> Look at you, you're in shambles. Uh, don't worry, I can fix it later. All I need is a needle and thread. <laughs> yes. It is useful. True. Take the car and leave the cannoli. <laughs> He did both. Friendship, red alert. Thunder baton's on. <laughs> Benjamin Bratt's with them. Well, look at hey. you. You're bumping the noggin and you think you're Pancho Villa. Who? <laughs> Time to take a stand, pal. Oh, good. And while you're doing it, loan me a gun. Loan me two guns. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> loan me ten guns. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Loan me two guns. I hadn't counted oh. on this, but I must say you worked out beautifully. What's new? People have always been terrified of me. Mm -hmm. Yes, but this time they're really intimidated. What is he? Didn't he die? Did he have a twin? He got shot. You can't take away people's right to be assholes. Hmm? That's who you remind me of. Ooh. An evil Mr. Rogers. Uh-huh. Oh, dang. Oh, come on, man. You didn't think that far. Like, Jesse Ventura right there can do. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, they love running this place. Bobby's yeah. for the pile. Bobby's for the pile. Oh. Whoa. Painful. Excuse me, but the police are here. <sighs> Proto blade move. Yeah. Them We're back angles. to touch. <laughs> yeah, oh, come on. Oh. Whoa. Ah. Fight in line to get to Hall H. It gets brutal. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Good shot. Someone that hasn't used a gun. Hey, where the hell did you learn to kick like that? Oh, um, Jackie Chan movies? Uh. Yeah, it's good. The classics. <laughs> My peer, your grandfather. Looks like the cocktail player just went up in smoke. <laughs> I see what you did there. I see what you did. He's access to cryo prison. He's about to defrost the entire multi-life away. Most of them don't like you. How many are there? 80. Oh. I now understand that under certain circumstances that violence is necessary. Good. Whoa! Ah, uh, yeah, it's for your own safety. Yeah. She's gonna come save your ass at some point. Mm -hmm. Yes. No, oh, I hope my foot didn't look like that. Okay. <laughs> I, I, we missed that out on some, some snipes butt shots, and that was that definitely, was definitely ad an ad lib. <laughs> hope my butt didn't look like that. Thank you very much, but your services will no longer be required. Oh yeah. Oh boy. Send the maniac to catch a maniac. Yeah. That's what I say to myself every time before I come into the office. Every time we're going to do a reaction, I'm yeah. like, you know what? Takes two maniacs to react to mania. God. Yeah. Nice. Flying double get gun the, jump. Get, get the jump. Woo. Yeah, reload. The claw. It moves. Oh, oh. No. It works. It works. Can't pick up Stallone. No. Oh, you're, you're 
God, that. D- dude. You're going to lose your place in the new administration. Puns for days. Oh boy. Oh dear. Oh dude. <laughs> what a fun set piece. Yeah. <laughs> How is Batman gonna thwart the Joker this time? He is 100% <laughs> an immaculate Joker <laughs> alt. Oh please, Wesley Snipes Joker. I want it. It's so fun. <laughs> On, smash it. Next time it hits. I can drag you in that vanity frost over there and fry your ass like a chicken. <laughs> With my little kiki, drop your monkey ass down. Ooh. Oh, jeez. Ah. Hey, there's a dude in there. I mean, there was. <laughs> My God, laser gat! Oh no, don't arrive! You want full palps? Woo! Yeah. <laughs> what am I doing wrong? Prior prisoner reanimation sequence now entering final stage. I hate when things go wrong. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is it cold in here, or is it just me? No. Oh. It's an Arnold line. <laughs> Yeah, let's kick some ice. Must be some Spartans in the atmosphere. Ah? Uh, ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> sure. Fair. Weird time to say it this late in the game, but I, mean, I get it. I'll see you in hell, nice. Ooh. Yeah. They're both so legitimately fast. Yeah. Gotta get the rain. Gotta get the rain. This is the best day of my life. <laughs> this is the best day of mine. Ooh, yeah. Oh. oh. Yeah, catch it. Yeah. Okay. Not it's always bad. the thing on the floor. <laughs> always look down. That's how they get each other every time. Gas, electricity, ice. Oh! He Jason X'd him. Woo! Oh! Ah. The headless thing. The headless ah, thing. It did come back. It's, it's Jason takes Manhattan with Man. the head punch combined with the Jason X nitrous smash. Nicely Perfect. done. Everything we needed in the 90s. Oh, man, he lost his head. <laughs> Andy Fudge the Explosion! Let's do it! Let's do it! Everything we need! This is cinema! Go on! Oh, Jump. practical explosion! Do it! I want to I switch the shots, personally. I would have yeah. had him run and then show him them. I mean, it's, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. okay. Oh, he, he took his head off. How will we live? I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to go out drinking all of us, get shit-faced, and paint the town, literally. Look for graffiti, slogans. It'll be a blast. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm going to tell you what you're going to do. <laughs> Dennis Leary's from Boston. You were lucky. And somewhere in the middle, I don't know, you'll figure it out. Fucking A. <laughs> yeah. Well done, Benjamin Bratt. You're a man today. You learned it. Huxley, I did it for your own good. We're supposed to be a team. We are. Oh. Hey. Oh, you did the dip. Definitely not my daughter. I did the dip. Are all fluid transfer activities like this? I feel disgusting. Oh, my. Oh. Cute. I think it's 
think I'm gonna like the future. <laughs> One thing I want to know. How's that damn three seashell thing work? Thank you! Yes! None of us know! What is the deal? How does it work? Comments, and let us know. How can I adopt the three it's seashell method? How do I implement method? a three seashell situation in my life? <laughs> Man, that was fun. That was an absolute blast oh my god i understand everything except the she shells and how he teleported to be next to him yes that, that was movie confused. magic it was jack black it was for like a frame it was and for like the a background. hot there second been some background it was jack black okay. that's gotta be like maybe the first the i feel like the 90s and, and and like heading even into the 2000s there was this period where you would have these like yeah jack black as like featured extra like it happens yeah. in paul I rudd mean, was doing video game commercials jack sure. black i'm sure they pop up sure. and stuff yeah right Running Man, I've also never seen that. Oh, me neither. Hey. Up next. And it's a little Let's do a double buddy. movie. Let's just dive in. Oh, my God. There's a Sting theme as oh, well. Oh, the 90s were exquisite. Wow. Oh, it's on right now. <laughs> you guys can't hear any of this, but also, this is. Get on Spotify. <laughs> this is not what it's not I great. was expecting. Not, not what I was. I love Sting. This is Sting really, really reaching for. This is like Sting. You're you're popular enough to that we'll, we would get you for Whatever this, you even want. though your type of music it does not, not translate. <laughs> it's just Sting and cocaine as co-leads of the song. Like that's a lot of cocaine. Oh wow! This uh, this was a yeah. what a ride. This was a, an absolute blast. And I do gotta say, like this to me really does feel like and and i know that we're we're disparate a couple of years you know give or take but uh this really does feel like the street fighter to face offs uh mortal Kombat, and what i mean by that Love is that. like you know mortal Kombat as opposed to street like street fighters is like non-stop and madcap and wild and wacky and mortal Kombat occasionally tries to slow down and have mood <laughs> and i feel like this is is like you know you've got john woo doing face off so there are those moments where it wants to be very dramatic whereas this epiphany. is just like we're going man we're just moving a peach <laughs> oh, i could eat a peach for hours oh my god but you yeah. finally saw that right oh yeah, yeah. okay i good. reacted to it on this oh, channel man so another if you one you want to see it go check it out boom um but uh, what yeah what a journey this was this was the Street Fighter. Like you're totally that is such an accurate description. This was just a blast of two actors doing their thing in an exact script design to let them do their thing. Mm -hmm. Like that was just joy. Yeah, man. And it's like, yeah, there are a lot of things that you can think about, especially in hindsight, because yeah, you got Stallone here and you're like, D -d -d dread? And you got freaking Rob Schneider's around. And like, Again? Yeah. And uh, and so like it's fun in hindsight to see the sort of overlapping in these kinds of movies. But uh but yeah, I mean this was a total blast in that sure, it it harkens to I feel like they make a number of Brave New World rec because as I remember, my vague recollection of that book, we read that in 1984 and it was like, oh, here's one future that's clearly, you know, a dystopia and, and you know, fascist for various reasons. And then here is the Brave New World version where it's supposed to be this sort so of sterile. tranquil like, utopia. But but yeah, but you realize that's dystopian in its own way, if I remember correctly. Like, yeah. And there are also, you know, uh, the one song is the stick <laughs> song. Sorry, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. That's just a moment. It's all good because the rest has to be plop, uh, plop, fizz, fizz. <laughs> the rest has to be jingles at the You're music in a like, generation yeah it's like they took that idea of like oh, okay the tranquil utopian future maybe has some dark secrets lurking beneath it or maybe there is value to the shadow sides of life um but yeah i thought they did just a really nice job of realizing this world like as madcap as this is like it's not quite i don't think as like smart surprisingly as like a robocop sure. but it does have that future where you're like you know what and especially watching this you know uh 20 odd years removed yeah. from when this came out originally Originally, like this does feel like a a reasonably kind of semi plausible take on a future. And Speaking I like of that it was credited as the new L.A. Convention Center with new in all caps. Yes, by the way. of course. So that must have been they probably like made like a deal in getting because they filmed like so much of the movie in that in that oh, yeah. one location. Yeah. So it's really interesting. Like that was the future of then and now it's like we go there yearly and it's like this normal you know what I mean like the new LA Convention Center well and this movie had so many there was the LA Convention Center and I feel like there were a couple others as well and I oh, feel the like outside the outside future a couple times yeah and maybe even Long Beach in there at one point like, yeah. the, like this was like everything in the future is based off a convention center's architecture because you need that much space for Stallone and that crew to blow stuff up yeah but I, it's like I, I, I appreciated the way that this drew it's sort of 
quirky future because in the outset you're kind of like okay i see the wasteland los angeles used to be before you know the big one and and the reset and then you see the future it is now and at first you're like well this is kind of peaceful and and sort of nice and and it draws i think a nice level of humor out of that because it makes sense as to why like everyone you meet especially you're mostly meeting like cops and and you know people in charge and they all feel like children in a way and they all behave like children in a way and there's something oddly endearing about that but that's also quirky and fun to then see contrasted by the mania of wesley snipes and just the you know stone cold badassness of stallone and and even that like you know i like that they paired him with sandra bullock because she is like so plucky and so you know affable and good natured. Yeah, and and Stallone like remains himself, but he softens in a way that is ever so slight, but quite endearing even still. This must have been right after Speed. Yeah, must have been. It, it feels like there's some of that in here. This too. was, I mean, like Anne Sandra Bullock, like coming off of Speed, like being the action heroine to cast, mm-hmm. and like this was so. I, and this is a this is a compliment. But this is so <laughs> of the time in yeah. Wesley Snipes' is super popular martial arts. Stallone is like the big action guy. They're referencing Arnold. Sandra Bullock is like fresh off of speed, it seems like. They've got a lot of in-house references where like Joel Silver would not get away with putting a Lethal Weapon 3 poster's equivalent in a Today movie. Like they literally were plugging stuff, but I love that it was all because it was the future of the present. So, like, 1993, Lethal Weapon's about to come out. You've got that poster. And then that's the future, so they got all these throwbacks. But none of it felt cheesy enough to remove. It actually, like, really worked tonally. And I really love the idea of, like, L.A. Underground being, like, New York, where, like, there's that whole New York City that's under New York present. And I loved the... The scabs being kind of the good guys. Like, they just want to eat. And I love the the sterile dystopian future of, like what the future could become if either party or either um, idealized goal takes too much control. Like, yeah. I, when I said fascist, like, I would not let someone track me. Like, I would not let a plug be in my hand. And, like, they're doing neural link chips today. Like, they're literally <laughs> starting human trials. Like, like Elon's out there, like, making Twitter yeah. burn on fire, and they're going to put human trials. And I love the goal of that is to help people with seizures. But the reality is if you can't run a website, you shouldn't run people's brains. But my point is <laughs> we're living in, a, in an age where, like, it's not far away. Yeah. And I love that this was set in 10 years from now. And I love that this has a lot of, like, those look like Teslas. And yeah. there's a lot of stuff that this really is, worked. This age. The iPad. Quite they were well considering. Like, like it's, this is one of those views of the future. I feel like a lot of times you watch a movie from the past depicting the future, and you're like, oh, how quaint. Yeah. This is what you thought it would be. And, and they this video movie. They video-chatted on iPads. That's a major, like, if you think about 1993, how futuristic is video chatting on an iPad? And it's like. I feel like a lot of the things they did here, and even the concept of cryo, like, you know, you, you miss out on all that free labor, not to get too topical, mm-hmm, Anya, but, mm-hmm. like, all these things that they had, all these trappings of this future felt oddly not too far-fetched, again, given that we are close in time to when this is supposed to take place, but also, too, on that same token, I feel like all the cheeky pop culture nods and, and you know, like President Schwarzenegger and all these various things aged pretty well too because yeah. those are all for the most part at least for me watching this for you i think too like mm-hmm. watching this you're able to catch all those references and like you know they sing that one jingle that's i don't know if that one jingle they sing apparently is real. The five jingles were real i read them all okay. they were like jingles of a time i think so that that dog food one i didn't so much recognize but the, the joke still plays and there are other ones that you do recognize and uh, and and there's even that sort of like idiocracy I, like you watch a movie like that and you're like, yeah, they must have taken some notes yeah. from this with the whole Taco Bell thing. Yeah. Which, which, which was a major plot point. Which was a major plot Taco point. Taco Bell was the third lead. And now it's, it's coming back to me. And I'm sure somebody in the comments has already gotten to it. But uh, if I'm not mistaken, I think this might be the movie where uh, there's like in one territory somewhere else in the world, they couldn't clear Taco Bell. So it's Pizza Hut, I think. It's so I much could work. be wrong about that, but I feel like that is an aspect of this here. Um, I love this. I love this too. I, 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 it's and like also, a new old classic. Yeah, like it's one of my movies I'm gonna watch again and be like, I get Demolition Man. Like it yeah. didn't lose itself to the fact that I didn't grow up with it. Yeah, and it's like I, I love that you have these two central figures who remain quintessential, and yet you also like it doesn't really focus as much on the whole like what do we really do to fix the future? No, because, there's not a lot of moral quandary at the end because once they get to that point, they're just sort of like, I'll figure. What it out. are we gonna do now? And he's like, Well, like he's still 
Stallone steps in and you think he's going to like, you know, start the throw the first stone towards a better future. And he's he's just like, uh, no, you guys will figure it out. I'm and Stallone. I'm like, what do you want? From I'm me? like, they haven't figured it out. That's the whole point is like this way of of living arose. It forced a certain which handful of people underground, which is also a very sort of well-worn sci fi thing. I thought of, you know, a million things like equilibrium comes to the mind. Where it's that thing of we want to have the, you know, uh, difficult parts of humanity. We don't all want to conform to one sanded mm-hmm. down version of life. Uh, and so, like, it's there. I appreciate it. I liked um, Edgar Friendly and all that stuff. And and what they stood for. Part of me was like, are are Stallone and and Wesley Snipes gonna somehow unite with to fix them? the future yeah, and all of them? Yeah. With the 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 no, s- Wesley's the, too crazy. Yeah, the scraps. Uh, you know, I but, love but the yeah, scraps. I liked it ultimately comes down to, yeah, those guys are not gonna get together. But, you know, this there is cover. a better future that will blend out of these two. And I love that they didn't spoon feed us. Like, I love that it's going to be a struggle. Yeah. But I also, I was going to say, I, I don't think I've seen a cover of a VHS more. Yes. Like, that Those I haven't two seen. two facing each like, other. Demolition yeah. Man may be the cover of a movie that I've seen the most having not seen the movie. Like, there's, like, those yeah. iconic covers. This is up there. And I've also, and I'll admit this, and I don't know if you've seen it, I've never seen White Man Can't Jump. I haven't, too. <gasps> Dude, comments basketball time do I you assume. want us to watch white men can't jump because i'm a big woody harrelson <laughs> and a big wesley snipes fan oh yeah those are two w named actors i appreciate very much in one motion picture um yeah this was uh, absolutely incredible oh, I, yeah. I had such a good time uh this was in part because you love lisa is one of the ones people recommended and also uh this is a movie that i think um everyone needs to see like this is one of those like <laughs> yeah. you have to and so i'm so glad i did this was like an absolute blast yeah well, uh, and two if you like just real quick if you if you like action also like it's the even though there were times i wish they would shoot some of them you know you've got wesley snipes martial arts like yeah. sometimes i wish to be Could've able to for see wide. more of that i thought all the action all the stunts all the effects physical and otherwise really blended well together to make something that felt like you know, punchy and uh, and every you know hit, every explosion, you really felt that. This you know, five years before Blade. I know, it's crazy. It's crazy. It's five so years before Lost. Though, so glad you found this out, Blade. Yeah, it's so good. Yeah, found this very channel. Watch the this Snipes is Dude, here. The finally. Snipes is is here, man. What a guy. Uh, well, let's get a Patreon shout out Absolute in here. Vodka. Who is going to be our demolition man or woman today? Oh, who's lucky? Who's the lucky one? Who is our demolition? Mm, who do we got? Adelia Chamberlain. You're the demolition woman of the reject nation. I, I like feel it. like, I like you, that. you would be the John Spartan. Well, she's though, so you know? futuristic like, and tech savvy. That's so true. So she would be able to hack in interfaces and set up the future and mm-hmm. prepare one of us ignorant people trapped in the cryo to yeah, what the future is. Yeah. I feel like she'd be able to catch us up. Hundo P, and she's got that good moral compass, uh-huh. but she's also not afraid to give you smack if you need it. She's you our know? Sandra Bullock. Absolutely. She's aware of the 20th century. She's a little ahead of us, and also smack if you need it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little bit of Sandy, a little bit of Stallone. A little Appreciate bit of that. Sl- slidey. We'll call you Slidey. That's a great nickname. Sure, there's nothing better than that. No, no, sir. Put a pin in it, best, Coy. Best We're one. done here. Keeping that name. That's what you're going to get, Adelia. Thank you very much. Mm. Reject Nation, thank you very much. Remember to leave a like on your way out. Remember to leave a comment on your way out. Do you want us to watch some White Men Can't Jump? Do you want us to watch some Running Man? Do you want to watch some other movie, The Man in the Title? I realized that was very popular in the 90s. you want us to watch something, you leave a <laughs> comment below. I'm enjoying this Snipes Assance, and I'm enjoying us. Enjoy you. Enjoy us. Enjoy this Snipes Assance. We will talk to you very soon. Much love, Reject Nation.